Hi guys, my name is Pete Hutchinson and in this video for Wet's Photographic we're talking audio, more specifically the audio that I use in my videos. I'll be comparing the shotgun mic to the lavalier mic and show you some pros and cons for each one. So the first microphone we're going to look at today is the shotgun microphone. It isolates noise so it picks up noise from straight in front and cuts down noise from the sides and behind the camera. It's great for just putting on the camera all day and you know you're going to have pretty good b-roll and dialogue shots. One disadvantage with this microphone is when the subject gets a bit further away from you, it can find it hard to pick them up. I love using this microphone for B-roll and setting the scene. So because we're at the seaside, I can get some really cool beach noise seagulls and it should really immerse the audience in the production. So here's an example of us doing that. So the second microphone I'm going to show you today is the lav or lavalier microphone. Now this is a compact little unit and a tiny little microphone that can clip to your clothes or shirt. Great for dialogue and it's also really good if you want to be anywhere in frame and any distance away from the camera to a certain extent and you don't have to worry about the shotgun mic being dead in front of you. One problem with this microphone can be clothing noise. So if you set it up incorrectly you can get some noise and interference which can really ruin your videos. To get away with this, you've got to make sure the microphone's away from your clothes, not touching them. And there's also some accessories you can buy which do help mask that noise. Now an accessory I use all the time is something known as a dead cat. Over 100,000 cats are killed a year to make these. No, I'm just kidding, it's all synthetic. But it's great because you put it over your microphone, it cuts down on wind noise, stops the gusty sounds, and yeah, it works perfectly. So in conclusion, if I was shooting run and gun and had a really busy day, I'd normally just lob a shotgun mic on my camera, but if I was shooting dialogue and maybe corporate and speeches, I'd always go for a lav mic. So I hope this video helps you choose a microphone for your next production, and I hope to see you guys very soon.